Hello, <clears throat> hi guys, good morning, good afternoon, good evening, depending on where you're watching from. Hope, welcome to Hope Alive with Mary. Something just happened and I thought that I should do this video quickly. Okay, I'm on my way to work now, I'm in route to work, and um, so I just had an experience. I dropped off my daughter first uh, in school before I started making my way to work. Um, I've got this route a couple of times and usually the sat nav takes me through a particular route. But today when I put in um, my office address when I left her school, I noticed that it was taking me through a different route. So I was like, no, I know where I'm going. So I ignored it, went on where I normally would have um, been heading. He tried to take me back there. I still ignored. I kept going. So he was reconnecting, trying to reconnect me back to the place. And I was not listening. So anyway, eventually, <clears throat> and I continued on that the route that I was familiar with. But something happened while I was... Um, <clears throat> But then again, it took me to another route that I was not familiar with. So I was like, oh my God, what's wrong with this start now? So I just said, okay, let me, because at that point, I didn't even know my way from that point because um, I usually don't, you know, take that route. So I didn't even know my way. So there's no way I would have ignored it. So I just reluctantly followed. But the problem then was I found myself moaning and complaining and moaning and complaining all through my journey. I found myself just constantly just, you know, just complaining. I felt that, no, this is not where I should be going. I said, what's wrong with this thing? I checked a couple of times. Did I put the correct ad office address? Did I, you know, miss something? And it was correct. I said, but why am I going in this direction? Why is it taking me in this direction? Do you know I spent most part of my journey <laughs> just doing that? Complaining and moaning and complaining and at the end of the day I asked myself a question do I know the direction to where I do I found I had no clue of where I was I didn't know where I was so if I were to go my own way where was I going because <laughs> I didn't know where I was so I had no alternative than to follow the leading of the Sadna the only choice here is to follow the leading of the sat now because I didn't know where I was going. I didn't, I didn't know where I was. I didn't even have a clue of where I was. And this sat now is telling me, turn right, turn left, go whatever, whatever miles, uh, at whatever, you know, yards, turn whatever. Take the first, the second, exit, and all that. And all I needed to do was just obey. I was obeying, but what I was doing was doing it grumpily. I was so grumpy. I was so, like, I just kept talking about it and said, why are you taking me through this route? It does this actually lead to where I am going? Eventually, here I am. It actually brought me to where I had, you know, that we had an agreement about. So, what is the lesson here for me? And the story that came to my mind was Joseph. Because God said, that the agreement with God was that he was taking him to the throne. He was taking him to the throne. But what happened with Joseph was Joseph began to, when God began to lead him, the path in okay, which God was leading him didn't lead, look like it was going to take him to the throne. It didn't look anything like this. And I'm pretty sure he would, would have asked a couple of questions. God, are we on the right path? Are you sure this doesn't look like, you know, what we had an agreement about? So, and, but God who knows all, the all-knowing God, the God that knows the right path and the best path. I'm sure the sat nav had seen traffic and congestions in the other route that I knew. And decided to take me to the safer and the better one. Eventually I'm here. And I'm here on time. I'm not even late. And that's why I can sit down here and have, you know, this talk with you. I am really, I'm early. I'm about 17 minutes early. So at the end of the day, what's the point here? When God is late, the Bible says, do not be wise in your own eyes. Acknowledge God. Direct, let him direct your path in all your ways acknowledge God and allow him to direct your path and that's one of the big prayers I prayed this year that God please direct my path and it, really I learned a lesson by in this my journey today that sometimes the path in which he's leading you might not look like what you know you are envisaged or what you are familiar with or what you're comfortable with but trust the one who is leading you trust we remove complaint trust will remove anxiety, trust will remove 
you know every other issues that you deal with while you are on your on, when you are en route to where you're going so i would have enjoyed my journey better if i had just shut up and just followed the sunnaf and then I would, there were other things I could have done on my journey, which I normally would do. Normally when I'm driving, whatever I'm listening to, something I'm praying, I'm worshipping. And I didn't do that today, at least after I dropped my daughter. Why? Because in the last 20 to 30 minutes that it took me here, because I was just busy like, where am I? Where am I? Oh, goodness. This Saturday, I hope you're not just, a, you know, I was just uncomfortable. I was just anxious for nothing. Now I'm here. I'm here in good time. God will lead you there. If you trust him, I learned a valuable lesson this morning and I wish to share that with you. It might not look like where you want to be or where you're going right now. Just trust God. Follow his leading. Follow his direction. He will take you there and he will take you there on time. Hallelujah. God bless you. Have a glorious day. I'll see you guys again very soon. Bye-bye. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, please do subscribe. Like it. Share this video. Let it be a blessing to others. Your pain. We work out for a game for you and for others. God bless you. Bye-bye. See you later.